आर यू स्टिल लुपिंग थ्रू थाउजेंड्स ऑफ डेटा विच आर फेस्ड यूजिंग ऑल फंक्शन और गेट फंक्शन इन लेरेवल दैट इज द इजिएस्ट वे टू किल योर सर्वर्स मेमरी लेट मी शो यू टू लेरेवल ट्रिक्स दैट डू इट स्मार्टर सो लेट से यू हैव अ पोस्ट स्टेबल विथ वन लैख प्लस डेटा एंड यू आर फेचिंग ऑल द पोस्ट डेटा लाइक दिस हियर वी हैव यूज पोस्ट ऑल मैथड एंड दिस इज फेचिंग ऑल द पोस्ट एट वंस एंड देन वी आर लुपिंग इट इन ऑर्डर टू प्रोसेस इट दिस सिम्स सिंपल राइट but laravel loads everything into memory first and that is dangerous for large data sets hence instead of this you can use laravel chunk function and this will process the data in smaller batches so let me show you firstly let's comment this and here instead of post all i will be using post chunk function and inside this chunk function i will specify the number of records that i want to fetch from post table so i will specify like 1000 Now next I will create a callback function and I will extract all the posts. Now further in order to process the post I will iterate it using for each. So we can write posts as post and further we can process this post. This saves the memory by only loading 1000 records at a time and this is perfect for exports, email jobs, reports and more. But what if you want to process one row at a time? there we enter into lazy function so laravel provides lazy function as well and that will process the single record at a time so let's implement that as well so i will be writing post colon colon lazy and then i will iterate it using each function and here we will extract the post and this will process the one post at a time okay so laravel uses generators under the hood This makes it super efficient especially if you are looping through 1 lakh plus rows and doing db operations now you might be confused between choosing chunk and lazy function let me make it clear for you you can use chunk function when you are okay with small batches and this is fast and flexible in other hand you can use lazy function when the memory is a big concern or you want row by row streaming and you can avoid all or get functions for anything heavy and both of these are perfect for cli scripts addition commands or background jobs if you find this tips helpful you can like this video and you can subscribe to programming fields for more laravel tips